Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Asterix Solution. This video we are going to work on practical 5.1 that is printing a loop like this or a pattern like this. It might seem like you have seen this every day but this is a different pattern. So let's dive into it and start with that. So what I'm going to do is right click on my web content and create a new JSP first. So here comes my JSP and let's say now print pattern one dot JSP. So I've made print pattern for practice once to just check the output. So I'm going to just write it here. Okay. So no input needed. I'm going to write it directly. So int k is equal to one for int i is equal to five. Now try understand. I need to run the first loop for five times, but the value I need to print is not five. It I need to print is one. So I need to take another variable outside so that whenever my loop is getting used for five times, I print it one 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 one. So int i is equal to five. I is greater than equal to one and i minus minus. So five is obviously greater than one, so it will go ahead. And in the other part, I'll write one more loop for int k is equal to one. K is less than equal to i. So I'm connecting both the loops. I want the loop to run for five times first loop. Then again, I want to run for second time for the loop. I want the outer loop to run for four times. So, so on, it will keep on coming down. And in the internal loop, I'll just keep on printing the values. So internal loop, I'm running for as many as time the value of outer loop is. So int k is less than equal to i. Uh, sorry, not k. Int j is equal to one. J is less than equal to i and j plus plus. So I'm running that opposite way and out dot print. I'm not using print ln, but I'm using print. And what I'm going to do, you have seen that I've taken a value for K, which is one. So neither of the looping values will be helpful for me here. And I am not good with HTML. So I don't know how to make tab space here. So I'm just putting up spaces out there. And after this loop is completed, I need to give a break. So out dot print ln a break tag. And let's increment the value for k here so that every time the loop is running uh, the for the very first time the value of k was one the loop was five five time it will print one 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 the loop increments next time it will print two 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 three 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 four four and five so let's try to run this loop and try to run this program so i say run as run on server finish you can see the same output the desired output what was here of was achieved in my application you can find the code for this particular program in the description box on the blog side of mine and thank you for watching this video do like and subscribe for more videos like this thank you